Don't lose the hype! Are you guys sure we can switch to big cam? Yes, yes, yes. yes. We've got the stuff mean? we are not You're allowed always to You're always beautiful. Ha! Oh, huh. yeah. Okay. Oh, look. The Doran Bolt, Ren, has a nice male voice. I think you oh, mean Cole, terrible. who's over yeah, on the side. That's, that's not me. Welcome Thanks, to the though. Rift live stream. Uh, this is our uh, Dimension stream today, the Dimension Nerd stream. With us today we have Griff. He is a critic of all sorts of dimensions. And our super special guest, Katasia, or Katasia. See, I will get that right one day. So Katasia <laughs> here, or Kit. Now, you'll notice derpy-looking headphones, derpy. right? Oh. Derpy. Totally derpy-looking headphones. Now, this is Muzzy's fault. He decided that we needed to look more professional by... You're going to break the microphone if you do that. Gee whiz. Okay, so... I hate these things. They're horrible. But because Katasia's here... Joe knows that I'm going to have to put these on my head. They make good sound, really. No. Even though they're messing up my hair a little bit. It's like the Princess bit. Leia hairdo was not in fashion when it first came out, and it's still not in fashion. <laughs> See, you're laughing at me. I swear. But if it went... Oh, and they're big. They're, they're made for big man heads. Man heads. Okay, fine. I'm done. Totally done. Okay. Uh, we are still actually patching the servers. I swear, we came in here we yesterday, we tested everything. Katasia was able to log in. We've got her back today. That part worked. But the rift, rift is not with us today. It's like the force is not with me. It'll happen. Yeah, okay. Uh, right, so we want to talk about the fact that we have Dimension Bonus Weekend. And if you could just switch to the other screen. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Secret stuff there. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What is that? I don't. I don't want to look. I don't at know that. if you. I'll. I'll just say. I'm so excited. Yes. I have a keyboard. Do it for all current items. Ah. Oh. Copy and replace. Dude, where is the Deb? She's ignoring us now. Deb, help! I'm totally gonna. You skip want me one. to go fetch her? No, if she's not listening. I'll just smack her. Later. Do this for the next 96 Maybe she clicked that. This is not. Tech stuff hurts. It's really painful. Ugh. Okay. How secret was the secret stuff? Oh, the secret stuff is secret. It had three Ks we're, we're not secret. allowed to. We're, we're, we're not allowed to that talk about secret. it. Okay. Anyway, we can switch to the other screen for now. Hopefully nothing secret will come up. Oh, here comes Deb. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Give us a second. Switch it back to us. Because Deb is now here. Oh, well, well, this is not the secret stuff, by the way. Okay, Deb, check the check the stuff. Okay, okay, oh, okay. Deb's uh, invisible because of her shirt. <laughs> oh, I'm a transparent Gosh. Deb. You know, we, we like to talk about transparency here at Tryon Worlds, and we're putting it into practice. I'll just sit on the couch. Wait, move in front of the doggo again. I want to see the doggo. Oh, no, he's part of the Yeah, she's still <laughs> opaque, so. I'm a fool. Thank you. It's also, Thank you. it's Bring Your Dog to Work Day, National Bring Your Dog to Work Day, and at Tryon we often have a whole bunch of dogs, half of them are corgis, so Griff's here representing for the non-corgi breeds. He is a Brussels Griffon, and he is also the secret source of my dwarf beard. Yes, secret source. once a year, <laughs> we trim off all of this nice long fur, and it becomes my beard. Now you know. I need you to type password. Oh. There's no prize, by the way, for best One, bring your two, dog to three, work. One, two, three, I love Griff. 102, right? Right? Yeah. Don't, no, Griff, don't talk. My password is small. Muzzy Sucks. Don't do that. There we go. Okay. He's muzzle now, I thought. He is muzzle now. Yeah, the RKH players have renamed him. <laughs> Okay. 
So, well, now Deb is just testing this out. Uh, what, again? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one more time. One more time. All right, all right. I'm just glad y'all can't see my passwords. I could just see all my characters. It's a pen. Oh, it's a pen. I've been corrupted work. twice. Yeah. Oh, it's a pen. Okay, okay, maybe it'll work. Looks like a grumpy old Wookiee. Oh, yeah, boy. No, 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 no. He, he's a grumpy little Ewok, see? He'll do all the right. jump, jump dance works. for you. Thank you so much. No problem. Okay, so now... Oh, man. We never want to do this again. Okay, so, back to the Dimension Bonus Weekend, which is what we're here to talk about. The Wookiee's growling. Oh, he's an Ewok. That's why he's growling. Get up on the couch. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> he's, a, he's a grumpy old dog. All right, so Dimension Bonus Weekend. Here we go. Okay, I'm switching back. Okay, yes. One day, I tell you. Yeah, this is before happy hour starts. This is why we drink. All right, so we now have working doors in game. Thanks to Tacitus and the uh, the art team, they are actually functioning in game. Uh, we're very very excited about that. Twenty five percent off all Dimension keys in the Rift store, and uh, we're we're uh, discounting the Alito Dimension box. There's uh, the old Imperial Wonders Dimension box is coming back, and that'll be dis discounted as well. And uh, all World Event Dimension items are going to be available in the Rift store for this weekend as well. And it started at midnight, and it runs through to 11.59 p.m. on the 25th. And so there you go, 25% off all this stuff. Now, it's really interesting because we've had people say, why do you make these crappy dimension items? Nobody uses them. Au contraire. Let me tell you that dimension building is an art form unto itself. Dimensions are the, uh, the, the player housing in Rift. And not to name any names, but I've been in lots of MMOs where the the player housing is really lame. You can build very little. You can put hardly anything in them. In Rift, on the other hand, you can build almost anything you want. So it is actually my favorite game for housing. Uh, so dimensions, you can have several of them, and uh, and they're a great way to to spend time in games. So and build uh, up your finger muscles. And build up your finger muscles. It it can be challenging, but the controls are actually pretty good once you get used to them. So if you check out the article that we put up today, we also have links to four of the leading sites. There are probably more, and I'm really, really sorry if I didn't link everybody's. So let's just look at Katasia's site first. Oh, it's purpley. <laughs> yeah, it's very purpley. This is Rift yes. United Addicts, and uh, she maintains this, and it's an amazing place to go look up stuff. So I spend a lot of time on here. I first came across this site when I couldn't figure out, I, I was looking for something to, to make it snow in my dimension. And I found out that she had a lot of YouTube videos showing you what things do and she's got this amazing site. So thank you again, Katasia, for coming online with us. The Dimension Touring Company, I've linked several of these uh, in, in the article as well because the Dimension Touring Company puts up some amazing contests and then posts all of the all of the results and builds in here. Rift 360 Home, another place for sharing Dimension stuff, and Rift Dimension Gallery. Look at these things. This is a this is the site that I go to to go look at uh, the various wow. dimensions that are available. Uh, I wonder if does anybody in the chat know how many dimensions there are currently? I there are a lot, so you can really. You can pick where you want to build and how you want to build. They have a guide there. Yep, 50 plus dimension keys. So we know that there are at least 50. Okay, so there you go. It's Dimension Bonus Weekend. It's on now, and you guys should totally check it out. If you've never built dimensions before, the other thing you need to know is that, uh, and I think it's linked here. Katasia, can you tell people where that, uh, what the name of the channel is if they want to join the Dimension Building channel? <laughs> So we have two channels, one for North America and Europe. Um, the North American channel is Dimension Addicts at Deepwood, okay. and the EU channel is Dimension Addicts at Zaviel. And feel free to ask any questions or if you need help, because everybody in each one of them is really happy to help everyone. They are. Anytime I get, uh, you know, sad. <laughs> 
<laughs> Anytime things are rough, I head over to our Skype channel and chat with the Dimensioneers. They're really a good bunch of people and they're incredibly helpful. Okay, so. Do you see the dog cam? Oh my Isn't God. Isn't it great? Look, look on the bottom. Dog cam seems drunk. <laughs> it's stable now. Okay. It's stable now. It's stable now. Okay. And Griff will lie there and do absolutely nothing interesting for the rest of the rest of the of the channel. Okay, can you please go to the main uh, the main screen again for a second? I want to see if we can get into the game. There we go. Okay. Let's have a look here. Now I'm in game. Let me What's the other one look like? Brass LT. That's Lathis. Uh now, did you, uh, Katasia, you sent me a list of the dimensions that we're going to tour today, and is that the order that we're going to do them in? Um, I, yeah, sure, why not? Okay, which means I'm, I'm actually on the, can we just do the, the North American servers first? Sorry about that, just because I happen to be logged into the North American So let's just make a Griff pet. Oh yeah, we totally need a Griff pet. I don't know how you do the first. What about a Griff mount? <laughs> okay, Katasia, what is the first, let's see, we've got, uh, Brissiol is EU, Brutalbach is EU, Typheria, we're too loud? No, I'm too loud. I turned her oh. down a bit. Oh, okay. You have the okay. power. Okay, Saviel, and then we got two deep wood. Okay, so we're going to start off on the American servers, if that's okay, just so that it gives me time to switch across to the EU client. Uh, so let's go to deep wood. Uh, let me select. And now I have to see. We've, we've had some interesting things, and I want to talk about this a little. I had to make a special GM character on all of the different servers, because as it turns out, when you're searching for dimensions, you can't see any dimensions other than the ones that are on your own server. Yesterday, I was talking to the devs about that, and this is something that is going to be changed. So I told them I'm totally going to talk about that, because uh, I think this is exciting that we are going to be able to search dimensions and go to dimensions on the other servers. It's still broken into North America and EU, but ooh, clean things. Okay. Oh, I on. need to get my thing later. Can I do that on yours? Okay. So, um, okay. So we can go to to the main screen, and I'm going to go to social. And it's interesting that dimensions are under the social tab because they are extraordinarily social. So we are going to search for. So we're on Deepwood. We're going to search for Cosmos by Cosmo. I should totally be wearing my glasses. You can make that closer to your face. Oh, look, there's your glasses. Yeah, there are my glasses. Oh, and that's the one we're going to. Now, Katasia, how did you pick these dimensions? Well, he's got a lot well I went through and I had a lot of people's help. And so we threw like 50 or 60 of them together. And then because I couldn't choose, I took a little random generator <laughs> and picked them out randomly after I saw which ones were so amazing. It was just too hard to only pick four on each side. Yeah, no kidding. All right, so pick mine. are you in here right now? No, because that's not the order that I thought I sent you in. I'm almost oh, there. <laughs> no, it's, it's, I'm sorry, it's not the order. It's, it, th this is because um, of the patching issues that we had earlier today. Sorry. It's very atmospheric. Oh, I've fallen through? Are you serious? Uh, Abby, can you walk? It does look a little bit odd, so I'm going to exit. Uh, I thought it was atmospheric. <sighs> All right. So now, now I have to do this again. I swear, nothing is going to work right. There we go. OK, I'm going to enter again. Don't Maybe let me fall jump, through the world. Jump while joining. Jump while jump. Really? Jump while you're doing this. Really? That's what they say. Do it, do it, do it. That worked. Oh my See? God. Okay. Whoa. Oh, it's like a game. Boy. Whoa. Ay, ay, ay. Whoa. Did I just come down a slide? Okay. That is super cool. So, another reason I chose these specific dimensions is because they're each one of them has a unique architecture to them instead of just the morphing once you get outside of the ship. Wow. Um, I've actually never been inside the ship because I've always fallen through. I thought it started outside. <laughs> so, and the ship is amazing from the outside. 
this is really cool. Okay, so when you log into it or okay. when you enter this dimension, you actually, is that a, a slide that comes down? Oh, look at this. Oh my God. Duck under, duck under. I, I, I'm not sure where to go. Okay, you walk, Katasia, and I will follow you. <laughs> well, I, since I've never been in oh, here exposed. on the inside, only the outside, I don't know what where to go. Okay, we will. Who are we going to follow? Look at that. Okay, we'll look at some of the stuff. Now, these are all, when you, being an expert in dimension building, when you look at this stuff, can you tell instantly what were uh, set props that appear just as they do when they're put down and which ones have to be constructed? Um, yeah, yeah, I can usually tell what's been morphed. So, okay. um, all of these items are so far that I've seen are basic items, but like, like you've got the walls and stuff that some of the other things have been added to them. Okay. Um, now, but how, how do we get down? Oh, oh, can we get, oh, we can get through. The, oh, oh, that, that is crazy. Whoa. Okay. That it's just tight roped walk. Dude. That, that was, that was that insane. Yes. But it went automatically. Oh my. Oh, yeah. there's an elevator. Here it is. I have just spent the last two weeks working on my dimension, and I thought I was doing well, and now I feel mm, I need very that feature for all jumping puzzles. Yeah, uh, no auto kidding. Cross. Wow, this is insane. I, I didn't even know some of these materials existed. Yeah, the building blocks oh, have yeah. been since 4.2, I believe. Oh, and they, oh, I love them. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Can you go to the Ruby's Cube thing? The Rubik's Cube thing. Now, I have seen that before. That's a puzzle cube. And can you can see some of these other ones. Whoa. They're very, very neat. And cool. I do have one of those. Nope, that's not interactable. That one is. Do they come from the, the Dead Simon thing? Uh, one of them does. I, I think these do. These are from uh, the Tox Dungeon, I believe. Very neat. All right. So we're going to leave, and I'm sure this is why Bose is here, but we're going to leave a little present of a artifact pinata in each one oh, of these places. Oh, I can't do this. No, you can't. Too bad. Man. So sad. This is super cool looking. I wish we could spend more time in each dimension. When I wish you could see outside because there's like a giant, there's a spaceship like from Battlestar Galactica out one of the windows and the whole thing is just wow. like if you, you come to where I'm at, there's you can see the planets and the space on the outside of the ship. All right. I do not know how to get to where she is. Someone suggested you get rid of your UI next time you're in there. Or make the chat box smaller or something. Um, yeah. Normally I keep the chat box large because I'm I'm normally interacting with players and talking to folks. And it can be very, very hard to keep up with all of the tells um, unless I uh, have a really large chat box. Right. Now what we're going to do is at the end of the stream, I will post a list of all of the places that we visited as well. Wow, this is something. Oh, oh, okay. I see what you mean. Wow. And as you look up, you can see the red sky, and it's it's just that beautiful. Is truly astonishing. I'm just gonna sit here with my mouth open through this entire thing. All right. Okay. I'm going to exit here, and we're going to go to the next one. Uh, let's go to uh, Zion Deepwood. I. Can we do that straight from here? Yes. Okay, actually, I won't be able to because I will lose my ability. But you can head over to Zai's build and I will meet you there because I actually have to take off my awesome form, go back to my dwarven newbie form. So you're, you're seeing the secrets of how this stuff works here. And now going to go see size. Your uber self can't go into dim dimensions. It interferes with my ability to put down artifact pinatas oh, and other things. Yeah. That, you know, I won't be able to attack anyway. That you won't be able to attack anyway. So, yes, we are going to the Asian Tea House. I think I've been there in San Francisco. built on the Moonshade Pools dimension design. Yeah, this one is really beautiful. All of the homes... Of houses, structures, whatever you want to call them. They were just so unique when um, I chose them. I mean, there's a lot of people who do the, the Asian themes, and they are all beautiful. And this one got chills because it was it has several different buildings in it that are really beautiful. I would vacation there. I will say that uh, 
I used to do a lot of building back when Ren and I first, when we first met as friends, that was in Star Wars Galaxies. And Star Wars Galaxies had a tremendous uh, building ability. Did and stores. Yep. And, uh, and of course, Ren had the habit of just uh, dumping all her stuff in a big pile and I would build things. And <laughs> since then, it's, wrong been, with that. it's been hard for me to get excited about player housing because some of it is really quite limiting. Uh, and it was a while before I realized how amazing it was in Rift. Now I am inspired to do more. That's so all peaceful right. looking. Oh, look. this! He's, oh, Dope Mage here has the title The Brass Basher. I remember that. Uh oh. This <laughs> is lovely. I could live in here. This is truly amazing. I'm just going to set down a pinata right here. There. Can you get closer to the tea? The tea? No, the I am I am not moving. Oh. I am not moving it. Okay, those guys are all going to go in and smash the pinata because that's the whole reason they're here. Oh. Oh, it's so pretty. I love that, that big tree. Yes, uh, there are a lot of plant items that are available in these uh, in the dimension uh, in the dimension section of the Rift Store, and also, of course, because some people have not yet discovered the joy of dimensions, and therefore you can buy dimension items on the auction house very inexpensively, and that's how I got all sorts of crystal and rock formations recently for my new dwarven fortress. <gasps> This is so Oh, there, pretty. that's what I wanted to see. Wow. Look how nice the tea set is. That is so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. They could put that on Rift Airbnb. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, wish we could stay there. Look, set down some, some of these little guys, too. There. A few spare extra artifacts. This is absolutely stunning. And, and then the last building is down the hill. If you look at it, it's bigger than the others, but it's still, the, the way the roof curves and everything is it's just amazingly beautiful. I'm really curious how, much, how many hours actually went into building this dimension. This is one of the most beautiful meditative dimensions I have ever seen. Oh my goodness, what is that? What is this cool thing, Katasia, this cool thing on the, on the wall here? On the window. It's one. It's the. Um, it's from Drumheim. It's a lamp, or says it is chandelier. Sorry, it's I glorious. I have a bad what memory for the names. I know the pieces of where to find them. But there are That's so why many. I made the Look, site. <laughs> you keep you keep a database of all of this stuff. How many pieces are there? Do you have any idea? There are over person? seven thousand right now. Over seven thousand individual pieces that you can use. Yes. <sighs> That's a lot the, of screenshots. That is a lot of screenshots. Thank you so yes. much for making record of them because, of course, it, it can be very hard to know what you're buying. And I can just go to sites uh, made by people like the wonderful Kataja and look things up and make a list. And that helps me build things uh, much more quickly than I would normally. All right. It, it also helps so that you don't purchase something from the auction house for like 50 plat that's actually like 20 gold. Yeah, that's actually a really good idea. Okay, so another artifact pinata. Here comes Bose. Oh my. Well, at least that keeps them busy. <laughs> All right, so we're going to exit this one and we are going to switch to the Greybriar server. Yeah. Yeah. Represent. Ooh. <laughs> uh, Tinker Toys. Oh yes, did you want to talk about Tinker Toys? I know you have a link uh, to that on your site as well as some other it, tools. Tinker Tools is the newest um add-on that we have and it helps you so that you can level things um, make sure that they're evenly spaced um, you can also save your sets so if you create something and it's a hundred pieces and you want to use it somewhere else you can click on all those pieces and save it as a name and then you can rebuild it somewhere else that's um, really terrific Oh, and also uh, Lotya says, I'd like to thank all the nice people who created the bank and crafting dimensions on all shards open to everybody. I have yet to go into one of those, but it sounds like a fantastic shared resource. And it really underlines the fact that uh, the 
the people who build dimensions are amongst the most generous, open, and kind people that I've ever encountered in game. Yeah, those are super handy. Not that not that y'all PvP people that we love so much and who we allow to smash us into smithereens all the time aren't awesome. All right, we are going to go to Cathedral of the Abyss by ShopSmart. Oh, this is going to be dark. Okay. Is it? Well, it's the Abyss. But it's okay. it's, it's built in the everywhere oh. dimension. Which should be really interesting. All right, did I tell me I didn't Something fall through? Something weird the... again. Nope, nope. Here we okay. go. Oh. oh my! That looks haunted, dude. That does look haunted. So now all of the item count was used on the building itself, so you can't go in. There's no decorations inside. Um, this because, is look, also look, no, no, no. We can't go in because we're not worthy to go oh. into this amazing place. All we can do... Shop Smart is, is also Fiendish's alt. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, super cool. Well, Fiend, I love your work, and this is glorious. So you get married at the other place and you come here to get divorced, right? Yes, this looks, oh. like, a, this looks like a really good divorce place. Look at all the angry statues. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, and I love Finish because she just does amazing architecture. All the arches and everything she created. Um, really? So Wait, this is really? All, These arches are not, are not no. uh, little set pieces? No, she created this. The, every one of these arches and the walls, most of this is building blocks. You've got the door that you know has building blocks around it, but all, every one of these arches in the windows the whole building she created that is something else I love the sky. and this is on the graybriar server now this yeah. sky does it come with the zone or is that a sky projector and can you talk a little bit about the sky projectors and how they work so i cannot see her item list so oh. i do not know i don't have everywhere <laughs> so i don't oh. know what oh, you don't. whether it's a projector or not because um, everywhere comes with you know i think it's black tier and I'm not done. Oh. <laughs> so. I, I know that um, it, I bought a sky projector and I tried it out in my dimension and I thought, eh, that's really not what I want. That's, that's not the effect I want. But it was the one that turns everything almost opposite colors, like negative colors. I, I can't remember what it's called, but it was really cool. And unfortunately, I am definitely addicted now because I'm already thinking about another dimension that I'm going to build out around the fact that that sky projector turns everything into really funky colors colors yeah the, the there are a bunch of different sky projectors for all sorts of different times of day whatever different skies you see in rift that you fell in love with like i love the conquest sky and i like the little embers that fall down from it That's i right. like how it turns everything purple so. yes. yeah. and aleandra that is absolutely correct it is the mind of the overseer Thank you. You see, I'm so happy that you guys know all this stuff that I don't. I am such a neophyte in dimension building, but, you know, we, we need to work cooperatively on some. I'm happy to dump things in a pile and I, do I, stuff with it, okay? <laughs> that's that's our usual <laughs> gameplay style. She leadeth me into PvP. I, you know, she dumps all my all the building stuff on for me. Uh, okay, so now the last one on the North American server that we're going to go to is on Fablight. So we will see you guys on Fablight. Is that the best oh, light? Oh, oh, that... It, no, no, no. That that only applies to sea stone, which is the best stone. Isn't this the best briar? The, oh, this is totally the best briar. <laughs> yeah, pitch black and, and neon. It's a really creepy thing for the, the mind of the overseer sky projector. Okay, so shard. Uh, fade light, fade light, fade light. Beep, beep, beep. And go. One second, I need to check something here. Deb just sent a message. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's a message for after the stream. Okay. And social dimensions search. I, I bet all of the professional dimensioners are just cringing at the fact that I don't know all of the shortcuts. Okay, I so do it the same way you are. Well, you know, we'll get to be experts sooner or later. All right, so we are going to go to Bristlecone Cottage. There we go. Really? Why, why didn't Dragonfly Falls get picked? 
Well, because uh, what, what Katasia was trying to do is get a wide range and style of dimensions. I mean, some of these have been extraordinarily daunting. Like, I look at them and I wonder, oh my goodness, how am I ever going to rise to that level? Mushrooms! <gasps> Oh, mushrooms. Oh, oh, the urge to collect. Ah, 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 I want to collect. Okay, I can't collect the mushrooms. This is a beautiful little cottage. That's really nice. Look at the light. Yeah, Holly always makes the most amazing little homey places, and her buildings are just so unique and made out of different items that, you know, you just don't think of using, oh, you know. My. Like, the roof, it looks like hay. Zoom but into first-person view so that we can have a better look around. I should have done that earlier. I'm sorry, guys. Look! Oh, at the little pantry! <laughs> it's oh, it's got cheese, a cake. Oh. <laughs> okay, this is. Oh, beautiful little wreath. Oh, this is so glorious. This looks like a place I would live. No, it looks yeah. like for big hobbits. I'm always so jealous of Holly's cottages. That's another reason I chose the architecture ones. I am terrible at building houses and anything like that. I can morph little things, but houses and buildings, I'm Super off cute. at. So, is, so again, this house is all built out of individual pieces? Yes. Like, the roof is rugs. Um, they're, like, for rugs. Really? and. You know, a lot of the walls are trees, and well, the sides, the decorations are trees, and you know, it's it's all just made out of different things that she's built. She built the windows, like the the window upstairs that's all curvy. That's that's all her. Mm -hmm. What's not true, lady? I I sorry. You got a fifteen second thing. This is oh, so that's all rugs. Oh, oh. yeah, I see. Sure. Okay, and that's the thing. Once you know what they're made out of, it makes perfect sense. But this is a, just a glorious little fairy tale cottage. Oh, okay. All right, uh, Tacitus here. Wait, wait, wait. Can you put that up on the window again? It, it says, don't leave dimensions un until pinatas pop. Oops. Okay, so I'm gonna put one. Okay, so we'll start putting the pinatas out first and what i'll do is later on i'll go back to all the other dimensions and put the pinatas out again i'm sorry guys hey this this whole having characters in game to interact with all of you is fairly new to us so we're, we're learning as we go along uh, and again thank you so much to dead set simon for making a character so that i can go around and have this sort of fun too can you go stand in the light yeah the sunbeams are are beautiful i think that's my yeah. favorite yeah and her details in the gardens and all of the plants that she's put out and where she's put them. I recognize these so little cute. tiny glowy plants. I put those into my uh, my arcane powered brewery that I'm building. Oh, this is beautiful. So, you know, I'm going to... It's a waterfall too. Did you see that? Now, is the waterfall part of the dimension? No, no. This is central necropolis. This is a dreary, dark... Really transformed dimension. So this waterfall was built? Yes. I am blown away. Absolutely blown away. Oh, look, there's laundry. There you go. You wash your furs. You hang them out on the line to dry. Oh, it's okay, like they got their life. pinata. I'll wait till they've picked up all the bits. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It's, it's you know, my Canadian development line. I'm so sorry. That one. I'm vicariously picking up bits. You're vicariously, yeah, mm -hmm. okay, mm -hmm. yeah. You know, I'm so sorry that you have to come on the stream with me and therefore you can't pick these up. Okay, so those guys are all Thank done this time. Thank you for letting me be here, is that better? Yeah. <laughs> okay, now I would like to switch to the main screen because okay. we're going to switch to the, um, to the EU servers for the four that we're going to see there. They say dream weavers can make waterfalls. Yes, yeah. I can and probably do I'm that. I'm a dream for you. weaver. You're a dream weaver. I've I haven't dream looked weavers. into the. I haven't looked into the higher end stuff. Okay, so I'm going to exit the game. Uh, Katasha, do you want to talk a little bit about um, some of the contests that are going on currently in the forums? And that so, way, I can do this. The one of the ones that is starting is the Cozy Cottages Three, ran by Dimension Touring Company in Finnish. Um, 
with this will probably be one of her last contests for a little while because she's being deployed. And oh, so wow. she wanted to get it out and she'll be so missed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I will so miss her very much. And then um, as far as uh, I'd have to go look on the forums, I think that's the only one that's available to both NA and EU. Okay. Um, if you want to know the rules of each of the contests, you just go to the forums and it's there. I believe that there's another one that's just available to North America. Um, uh, let me open up the Dimension Forums. Yeah, and I know that, that one contest just ended, the one to build the tree, tree houses. Yeah, out as, of as, soon as, I, as, as soon as we heard about that, Dead Simon logged into game to look at them, and he's he was in the Skype channel just raving about the creativity involved. Oh, I, I wanted to join that one because I really love building houses. I'm bad at it, but I like building the little houses. Mm -hmm. But my mom came. And my computer blew up twice, so I couldn't. So what you're saying is that dimensioneering is hard on the tech. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's the one you guys gave me. So from winning the Joys of Dimension contest, it really? finally broke. Cool. Okay. <laughs> I am now safely on the EU server. Secret stuff has nice been horns. hidden. I know. Right? Well, that, um, this armor is the default armor for the level 65 uh, power up set. Let me oh. just zoom out. So if you if you get the level sixty five stuff, this is it. And I and, and it's so much cooler than the noob stuff that I have on the yeah. North American servers. Uh, this is just so pretty that I decided, well, I'll just keep that. I do like the horns a whole lot. Plus, you could take an eye out. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> okay. So I am currently on the Brissiol server. And we are going to go see the Taj Mahal. I have seen pictures of this, and I think this is going to be really, really interesting. Search Taj Mahal is by Arwen. Uh, let's... Oh, I can't pronounce that stuff. You better say it. What? What are we trying to pronounce? All the things. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can only read some of them, like this one. Uh, que la force soit avec. Tell me what Saint I was going to say. Talara Land, I'm pretty sure you could do that. Talara Land. Yeah. Le labyrinthe diabolique. A diabolique. <laughs> <laughs> la maison de Père Noël. That's uh, Santa's, bless you. Santa's house. <laughs> Jeez. I, I, and that is the thing, is that it's... I, I love the naming of the dimensions as well. It's absolutely terrific to see what people... Which Name one do we get them. to see? We're going to go see the Taj Mahal. Oh, I can say there that. There it is. The Taj Mahal. <laughs> All right. And this is another one that's built built Whoa, on the Anywhere it dimension. It totally is the Taj Mahal. <laughs> it totally is Good the Lord. Taj Mahal. And again, uh, we're... I'm, put I'm, down your thing. Yeah, I'm going to go put down the thing. Yeah, so I, they said it. the other one is it takes a village. Um it's where you build a home for, like, say, a bogling or an elf, and not just the home, but like the little everything around it. Um, I apologize for forgetting. I do have some bad memory issues, and I didn't write it down because I didn't know she was going to ask. <laughs> you know, they say that people who forget a lot of things just know a lot of things that they then forget. It makes you more efficient. <laughs> oh, is that what it does? Yes. Yes. I'm sure read either read an article or wrote an article about this. I read an this. article, yes. <laughs> Actually, so well, now we use it this, as an excuse. Oh, sorry. This is another one where they built all the arches and the walls, and they <gasps> completely did the domes, all of it. I'm going up. Oh, my. <gasps> oh, this is beautiful. So... I have a question. As, as Dimensioneers, do you guys often get asked to build things for people? Like, hey, I'll give you 5,000 plat if you come build a Taj Mahal for me, that sort of thing? Yeah, uh, uh, we do. And I personally don't like building for other people very much. I've only done it three times, four and a half, because I forget what I'm doing. I will just go off and <laughs> not remember that I'm helping somebody or building something. And I, I tell them that too, um, because I do have severe memory loss. I, from uh, uh, brain damage, I tend to refuse to build for other people because I don't want them to be like, 
oh, I'm going to give you all these pieces of the meat. But there are a lot of people who do build for other people and they do wonderful jobs for them. I, I just, I, I would have a lot of trouble building something that takes so much effort and so much creativity and then just giving it to somebody else for mere plat. No. That's well. I, I, everything I've built, I've built for free. Um, I did Hello Kitty's Guild Hall. Um, the the hardest part with doing that too is that something gets moved, and you're like, "Why did you move it?" Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then I built every time vision. Guild Hall, and I built a gazebo for a friend. I am going to uh, now move to the Brute Walk server. Did you say the boudoir server? Yes, the boudoir server. No, no, it's German. Uh, Brut wacht. It doesn't say that. Yes, it does. It says so right Oh, up there. there. Right oh, there. Oh, oh, of course. See, here oh, cool. we are. Ah. Brut wacht. Yeah. You left again. It despawned. Oh, snap. What? But they, they killed it. Did oh, it? you know what happened? I threw a, a bunch of extra artifacts down, and they probably oh. pushed before people picked it up. But when I first entered that zone, I put down a pinata. So. Pick faster, yo. Yeah, pick faster. Be like Ren. Be on top of that stuff. Grab it. How many times have we died in battle in any game that has any collectibles, Ren, because you go running off to pick stuff up? They might vanish. The mob will always be there. Killing the rest <laughs> of your party. Wow. Details. <laughs> Okay. All right. So we are going to. All right. So this is nominally the German server. We should see what sorts of. And this is by Julia. So we can check that out. All right. WSG Atlantis. Oh, WGS Atlantis. Okay. Uh, is What is WGS? Is that a guild name? I honestly don't know. I would ask Fiendish because I never, I mean, I did know at one time. I knew like five times. But is it pronounced Wagus? <laughs> what I really like doing is when I first zone into a dimension, it is so cool to see the dimension itself and then everything loading because then you can tell exactly how much cool stuff goes into it. It's a guild. It's a guild. Okay, cool. All right, and we'll put an artifact pinata right there, and they should have time to destroy that beyond recognition. Ooh, okay, so that this one, when you first log in, you're like, where am I? What? I don't yeah, understand, exactly. but you see this little yeah, shiny like thing right here? Yes. Click it. <gasps> really? It's an interactive Ooh. thing? Yeah, it'll take you to the ship. Oh, you're flagged! Oh, no, I'm flagged. <laughs> it's okay. You're, you're in. <laughs> Everyone will be flagged the same. Tiger. Okay. Get and her. then through this door, you click again. Get her, get her, now, why she's not no looking? Oh, I can't, I can't, oh, there we go. Okay. This is amazing. And then <gasps> we put down oh, here. Oh, wait, I'm busy looking at stuff. Oh, sorry. Okay. Wait, can you look at the aquarium um, more? Yeah, let, let me just put down another pinata here. Shh, don't tell the other guys. That is... Like, all the doors oh, have the little fish. wheels, like, on a ship, you know, to keep the water out of each place, and... Oh, 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 look, the door handle turns. Okay, going downstairs. Oh, my. Oh, this is the coolest steampunky build I have seen <laughs> ever. Can you go through that water? Um, oh. Here is one more clicky. Oh, the oh side. No. So you're going to click one more time. Okay. This time, get her. Uh, 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 uh. No, I'm not going to get her. Just one poke. Oh, oh, my. Okay, I... I I'm just nerding out about this. Oh, wow, that is Atlantis. Wow. Wow. Okay, I have to come back when I have more time to explore all of these. Oh. And all of these buildings were built um, by uh, Ch 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 Chulia. Ch Chulia. <laughs> I'm Chulia. sorry. It's either Chulia or Chulia. Yeah, like all of the little arches in the dome and everything is just, this it was amazing. It is glorious. And you'd never guess that this was down here. Thank you so much for showing me hey. that there are little clicky things. What is that? That is you a, a mermaid. NPC mermaid. That's beautiful. Awesome. Oh. I hope they've, uh, they haven't killed the second artifact pinata. 
uh, dudes, there is a artifact pinata in there. We still have we still have uh, two more things to go to. Uh, oh yes, this is WGS Atlantis by Chulia on Brutwalk. Yeah, so so pretty. Okay, <sighs> I I am astonished and stunned and humbled and thrilled oh look there's oh. just more and more stuff the more you go down yeah oh. it's full of so i'm gonna many spend an hour and a half on this at. and i know we're gonna get kicked out of here really really fast um there's a place for a picnic up top yep I, i'm going to go to the next server which is typhiria sorry we're trying to get through these as fast as possible um and in the meantime cole if you could we, we're going to I'm run start giving things yep. away Yep, yeah, you start, oh, and then you can uh, roll for five snail mounts. Five snail yep, mounts. Yep, five, and uh, five of whatever the current lockbox mount is. Oh, yeah. And this is because our conics didn't tell me earlier what we were doing, so. Uh, also, if you guys didn't know, the Rift Summer Sale is on right now. And that means that the uh, Ascended Essentials pack is available at 50% off. You totally, totally, totally should take advantage of that. Keep in mind that comes with all of those souls, including the uh, the uh, primalist soul. Sorry, I can't walk and chew bubblegum at the same time, so trying to change servers and talking at the same time is killing me. Uh, the primalists and in, and with 4.2, the primalists, the, the rest of the primalist souls will be given to you for free if you already so own the uh, primalist pack, which is a really great deal. Okay, and here we go. We're in free march again. This time we are going to go to the City of Dreams, which is by Lovely, Lovey Stab. <laughs> Let me guess. A frug gotta be a, a fruit right it's city of dreams yeah, did you city say trees dreams. city of dreams is what i see on the list okay and I'm not wrong, so <laughs> i misheard you i was like no you're not gonna find it under trees it's dreams <laughs> let me see if i can find it based on this oh there we go it's I a lot less have... fun when you can't say oh that's the there names. because they're yeah yeah, here we go, here we go. Entering. Okay. You guys want to read the snail mounts? Uh, you can go ahead and read the snail mounts. I'm going to be over here putting down a pinata. Okay. Battle Piman, 31, want a snail. Eric Soak, want a snail. Dalzara, want a snail. Hey, that's Charles. I thought so. Yeah. So he's hey, really Charles. Watching. Shout Dance out. Time. Battle King 69 won a snail and Mac PTS won a snail. So Delzara, also known as Charles, uh, is one of our very good friends. He was a member of the first guild I ever joined, and he was the best man at my wedding. I got married to his best friend, Eric, who is known as Alluvian. So, hey, cool to see you in chat. Uh, these online games really bring a lot of people together. sure that's the right Delzara? Oh, it's the it's the only Dalzara. Online, it's the Another only Dalzara on Twitch. Okay, so okay. we put down a pinata. All right. And then oh. we got a the current lockbox mount, whatever that. Whatever may be. that may be. Greeny Trini, <laughs> Souls Fury six six seven six. Oh, is that somebody you know? That's Souls. He's helped us in PvP before. Oh, totally rigged. MMO freak go one. Oh yeah. Blythe. And me, oh. a crazy cat. <laughs> me, a crazy cat. That's a great name. This is beautiful. Look at how artsy this is. That is yeah. absolutely. I love the cool. colors in here. Look at the houses. It's adorable. It's, this one was created for the cake decorating contest. It looks like Epcot um, that Center. That happened a while it back. Does, it does look like, like, like Epcot Center. Wow. Bread's being baked. Oh, bakery. look, sheeps. You know what this game needs? Goats. It needs goats. Yeah. It does. It needs baby Absolutely. goats that jump. Yes, baby goats that jump. <laughs> or take a bottle. Oh, you know, baby goats are eval, though. Uh, I had a goat, goat escape incident this morning, and they chewed down my very young fruit trees. I was not 
happy. Just because they can. Just because they can. Oh, little beehives. Oh, yeah. this is absolutely glorious. We are so going to get kicked out of here. Uh, yeah, we have just... I have to kick you guys out. Okay, but we're going to go to one more. One more. Uh, okay, one more, one more, one more. Yep, there's only one more. Which which means, but the artifact pinata's not dead yet. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Well, okay, we're. I think we're going to have to let them finish killing this artifact pinata, and we may have to skip the last one. But the <gasps> last one is... Um, the Addict Collection. I'm, I'm just going to sit here. You know what? I can, I'm going to stare down the trove, guys. Well, it's not so much about them. Is that I have to log in to all of the social oh, media accounts. Oh, and that technical streams. stuff. Oh, but you could do that in like 90 seconds. Mm. Yeah. Right? I believe in you. No, it's all right. We'll get out. But I am going to go to that last shard, and I'm going to... Uh, set down an artifact pinata as well, and that will be on the uh, the Zaviel server sailors build called the Addicts Collection. Okay. And I plan to spend a fair bit of time today going around to different dimensions and just randomly dropping artifact pinatas, uh, because these are absolutely <laughs> glorious. And yeah, I know they're 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 excited to get in here, dudes. Okay, I'm gonna have to leave the zone. I I know the see. I'm speaking louder as if they can hear me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well, you can actually stay in while I'm setting up for the next stream. Oh, okay. All right, so we're going to sign off the stream. Congrats to winners. Uh, anybody who won the snail mount, if you already own one, give the code to someone else. Do not claim the snail mount. Give the code to somebody else, and you'll make a friend for life. Katasia, thank you so much for setting this up and coming on stream with us. Uh, you're one of our favorite me. people Bye. here. Okay. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye. See you next week. We're, we're probably going to drag somebody in from the dev team to do some talking about 4.2 tell you what. Bye! <laughs>